I'm what's uh, considered an immigrant, uh, an expat if I was white. Um, <laughs> I, I, I live in London and I've, uh, I've been in the UK for a few years, you know, I met a lot of uh, interesting people. I met um, what's the word? Uh, a racist the other day, uh, <laughs> which was pretty cool. Uh, had very uh, amateur racism though, you know, where he goes, immigrants who come into this country need to be more English, you know, which is subtext for, you know, be more white, right? Uh, no, normally I would have, uh, you know, gotten offended, stood up for myself. Uh, because, you know, mama didn't raise no little bitch, but... Uh, but, but this year I've been practicing empathy. Um, and, and I thought to myself, you know, maybe all of this aggression is coming from some place of logical thinking, right? Because can you imagine if someone came into your country, forced their culture, refused to learn the language, started stealing your things, got into your political structure, introduced racism, caused a communal divide that would last for decades and decades and when they left they took those stolen things and put them on display in a museum for you to come and see. That would be insane, wouldn't it? Yeah.